Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Derek Ray and with me for commentary is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division, Serie A. It is Atalanta up against Lazio. Yeah, thank you, Derek. Real pleasure to be here. Looking forward to this game. Players will be a bit nervous. I was always nervous at the start of games. It's important you get your first pass off to your colleague, maybe get a good tackle in, settle the nerves down. Looking forward to a good game here. And now they get the ball rolling. The starting 11 for Atalanta. Rafael Toloi plays alongside Mattia Caldara in central defence. And as for the attack, well, it has a bold look about it with three forwards listed from the beginning. Well, here are the players who will start for Lazio. Thomas Strakosha gets the nod between the posts. Stefan Radu plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Sergei Milinkovic-Savic plays with Lukas Leva in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. It's neat passing, confidence on the ball. Remo Freuler. And it's with Ilicic. Caldara, Martin Deron, useful looking position you've got to say, Remo Freuler, Ilicic, it's with Deron, so much to like about Alejandro Gomez, Lee, in your opinion, what will he deliver in this game? Well, if I'm a teammate of this lad, I want to get the ball to him as often as I can because he's a safe pair of hands. Give him the ball, normally something happens. The link-up play between the different departments of the team is second to none. Ilicic. Matija Caldara. Better at Jim Cici now. Mattia Caldara. Rafael Toloi. Martin Deron. It's with Toloi. Caldara. Gozens. Remo Freuler. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Correa. The ball with Luis Alberto. Working away patiently, looking for an opening. Can they take the lead here? In it goes! The opening goal in this contest! Well, this is worth another look, Derek. Lovely movement and guile to easily evade the defender. And a 2v1 is never fair. To be honest with you, the keeper's got no chance to stop this. It's lovely football. One nil then. Lazio in goal. Con il numero 11, Joaquin Correa. Ilicic. Atalanta enjoying the bulk of possession here. But after that, it's been really disappointing. Players are looking at each other. You've got to take control. You've got to take responsibility yourself. Make something happen in this game. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Could it be? And a goal! 
Well, let's look at this again. Magical football on the break. Surprise is the key. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. It's going their way. 2-0. Con il numero 17, Ciro Immobile. Ilicic. It's with Daron. Hans Hatterbor. It's with Zapata. Martin Daron. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Alejandro Gomez. Goodness me, he skewed that free kick completely. Wrong, wrong, wrong. Back to the drawing board, young man. If you're wondering about stoppage time, one minute to be added on. Milinkovic Savic. That is that for the first half here. Not to be too blunt about it. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Milinkovic Savic. Lukas Leiva. Radu with it. Correa. Poor pass under no real pressure. Going well. And he read it well defensively. Opportunity it is. Chiro Immobile. Milinkovic Savic. Pressure exerted, but he keeps the ball. Francesco Acerbi. The ball with Luis Alberto. Milinkovic Savic. Manuel Lazzari. But it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Well, they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Luis Alberto, now can they counter clinically? Marusic. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Jim City. Alejandro Gomez has it. Gomez. Martin Daron. Gomez. Not the pass he had in mind. The visitors are struggling with possession, really. But they won't mind with that. They're winning this game. They're sucking their opponents onto them. And with the pace they've got in midfield and up front, they're really causing problems. Ilicic. Remo Freuler. Patient enough build-up, can they carve out a chance? Jim City. Gomez. What can he do from here? Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. And giving it away. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. It should be! 
and it goes! A three-goal cushion! This is astonishing stuff! Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely, quick counter-attack that sets up the chance, and he composes himself, coolly slides it past a lonely keeper, who will be asking questions about where his back four went to. Well, if there were any lingering doubts Lazio about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Keeping possession of the ball with authority. Mattia Caldara. Alejandro Gomez has it. Duvan Zapata. Freuler in possession. Zapata. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Martin Deron. And it's with Ilicic. Rob them. Space on the flank. An incisive pass. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back, and he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. So they restart the game, and only one team in it. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. And that is the end of the game. It goes into the history books as a home defeat. Lee, your thoughts?